Hi guys, it's Lindsay, and today I'm going to be showing you what is inside of my backpack that I use at college because I've been getting a lot of requests to do this recently, so we are going to be going through my very heavy backpack, which is from Herschel. It looks like this. It was actually my sister's college backpack, and then when she graduated, she gifted it to me, which was so kind because then I didn't have to buy one. It is extremely full and heavy because I just am carrying around so much stuff constantly. The heaviest thing is definitely my laptop. I get a lot of questions on what MacBook I use just because I am a graphic design student so we are primarily using our computers so this is what I have and I would recommend it I love her <laughs> she's amazing she's everything to me coordinating with that I have a MacBook charger I usually carry this around because I spend a lot of time like on campus and in coffee shops and so I always need power for my computer I usually bring a phone charger too but I don't think I have one right now also important I have a sketchbook this one is from Canson and I use it for doing thumbnails for class and also taking notes. Here are some logo sketches for my branding and ad class. And I showed some of this on my vlog channel, so it's possible you've already seen it. But yeah, I always carry a large sketchbook with me and this is my favorite brand. And I really like them because you can tear it out um, cleanly, like without having the raggedy edges and like the paper has a nice weight to it. I also have a folder for sketchbook paper that I have torn out. So like finished projects and things like that. Um, I keep on one side and then I also have like printed papers on the other side so like here is like a syllabus that I have there's a bunch of syllabus syllabi there's a, I have a folder full of syllabi and here shout out to Chapman University they sell these for 99 cents in Arduros forum <laughs> this is the first year I've actually had like a solidified folder for carrying my paper Usually I do the method of shoving it in like the first section of my sketchbook, but then every time you pick it up, they fall out. So this is my new method and it has been working quite well. I also have a actual like planner for like planning out my weeks and writing down like homework and assignments and YouTube stuff. Um, and it just looks like this. It's from Staples and the brand is Ashley G for blue sky and it's really plain. I think it looks like a Dalmatian That's like what I always say it looks like but it's just like super basic and I really like it because of the size of it In addition to that, I also tend to carry around my journal with me Which is just where I write down like thoughts feelings lists ideas, whatever uh, It's really just to keep track of wherever my mind has been lately um, And this one's actually almost finished if you can tell where the ribbon is It's literally at the end when things are really stressful and I have a lot going on I find that writing is a really nice way to kind of channel all of that in and really just like think about where you're at currently um, as well as keep track of future plans and like future ideas and stuff like that because I'm constantly kind of trying to think ahead as far as like what I'm doing with my channel, what I'm, you know, posting when, and it can get a little hectic. So I like to make lots of lists. I also have a swell water bottle, which my roommate Delaney got for me and I love it. I use it pretty much every day and it keeps everything nice and cold, which is great. And I, I really just like how like hefty these are. Um, they just like stay compact and they're just, they're really beautiful, I must say. <laughs> Lastly, I have my glasses which I have currently in a crap eyewear case, but they are just my clear ones, which are from Warby Parker, and they are my seeing glasses, which I wear most of the time when I'm in class or when I'm driving. They're for distance, and I actually kind of need to get my prescription upped because I think the more time I spend on the computers, which is every day pretty much, um, my vision gets worse. So, yay! <laughs> Perks of being a graphic design student. Um, and then I also have my folding glasses from Ray-Ban, which if you haven't seen these before, I wear them all the time because I'm kind of like a buy one pair of sunglasses, wear them forever kind of person, and they just unfold like that. And so they're very convenient to like carry around and you can also like fold them up and put them in your pocket. I love them. And they are the extra large size if you can tell because I don't think that the smaller ones suit me as much. And now I do have some things in the smaller compartment. I have some headphones which are in a tangled knot. I carry these with me everywhere because I have to walk from my house to campus and it's always nice to just kind of like go into your own world while you're doing that. Also for working in coffee shops, absolute necessity. You never know what they're gonna play on the aux. Last time I filmed this video, which I think was my freshman year, I also gave out pen recommendations so I would like to give out some of those now. Okay, I actually have no idea what the name of this pencil is. I think it's by Zebra. It says MP M301. It's just a mechanical pencil, but it's 0.5 lead and I use this for drawing and sketching everything. It is like the most ideal pencil. I tweeted recently that I switched over from 0.7 to 0.5. 
it was a big step and um, I probably will never go back. And then I also have two of these, which are my absolute favorite writing pen and it is from Pilot and it is the Precise V7 Rolling Ball Pen. And this one's actually the v V5 and this one's the V7. So this one's fine, this one's extra fine, but I love this kind of pen. They like flow really nicely. Then I have two markers. One is a Pentel sign pen in red. I really love how bright this is. It's just like such a great pen for like adding things in your planner. Picked it up at the art store. And then I also have one brush pen, which all of the information has disappeared off of. I also have in my room just like bags of microns and Faber Castell pens and like Prismacolor markers. And so depending what's going on, I'll throw those in my backpack. But just like on the daily, I usually won't carry them around aside from just like pencils and black pens. I also have my car and house keys. I always end up with like tons of lipsticks and lip products in my backpack, but I only currently have three. I have the Urban Decay lip pencil in Naked 2, which I wear all the time, just like alone. It's my favorite lip liner. And then I have the Australian Australian Lucas Papa ointment, which I love. My sister sends this to me all the time. Um, and then I just have a classic chapstick as well as some eye drops because I have terrible allergies. I'm constantly breaking out in hives. And then the very last thing, I have a black hair tie in my backpack, which is also such a necessity. And that is it. That is everything in my backpack. I really hope you guys enjoyed seeing this video as it was very requested. Please be sure to give it a thumbs up if you did and subscribe if you haven't. If you wanna follow me on any social media, it is just at Lindsay Rem. And if you would like to get notifications for when I post videos, just click the notification bell button below. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you all very soon. Bye guys.